At Biotech Instruments in Winooski, business is good. Sales keep rising 10% a year. We have become a leader in providing life science instrumentation to the world. While it's hard to describe exactly what they make, their advanced microscopes and other technology are used in the hunt for cures to disease and threats to food safety worldwide. And everything is designed and manufactured here. That's an amazing story. That's an amazing story. Monkey brain. All right, we're tight. No wonder Vermont's top politicians were cheering, employees too, as Biotech announced its largest facility expansion ever, throwing a barbecue and beer celebration for 300 at the construction site. This facility is going to meet our need for the next six to seven years, at which point we're going to need to expand, we're going to need new space. So either we will look for additional space within uh, this park, or we'll need to look for another facility in Vermont to grow the business. You will stay in Vermont. We will stay in Vermont. The company confirms average paychecks run about 70000 a year. Many of their employees never leave. I started here in the stockroom right out of college, actually, and there was uh, plenty of room for advancement. No dramatic job growth planned with this expansion. Biotech says it prefers to hire slowly 20 or 30 new employees each year. For policymakers, the challenge is making sure companies like this one have enough qualified people. That's probably number one priority right now in building a workforce that is going to be here and stay here. Because for the foreseeable future, biotech is hiring. In Winooski, Stuart Ledbetter, WPTZ News Channel 5.